Hello students, welcome back to our channel Diksha Karnataka. Are you considering a career in computer science but not sure whether this is the right match for you? Yes, do not worry, you are at the right place. In today's video, we are going to explore this dynamic and ever evolving branch in engineering that is computer science. We will explore the reasons why you should pursue computer science and most importantly, after watching this complete video, you will have a clarity regarding whether your skills and interest align with what this branch offers and its requirements. Okay, so please stay tuned to find out if computer science is the perfect match for you or not. So, in this video, first we'll be discussing nine compelling reasons that tell you why you should choose computer science. In this, the first reason is high demand for jobs. Okay, so the tech industry is booming and there's a constant demand for skilled computer science and professionals okay so because of the advancement in technology there is a continuous demand for professionals with computer science graduates right so that is why this translates to ample job opportunities and job security in various sectors so you have a lot of opportunities in job because of the advancement in technology the second most important reason here is attractive salaries okay so most of you go for studying for four years or like four to five years with the hope that you will be getting very good package after this so computer science uh, has a very good uh, record in this it often offers very good salaries now computer science jobs often come with competitive salaries and benefits okay so its salaries are always very competitive so due to the high demand for tech skills okay so it's not that everybody is having this high skills. So those people who are very, those students who are very good with this technical skills, companies are willing to pay well for qualified professionals. Okay. So, but this does not mean that if you are joining computer science, you will be getting very high package. Here it is, like as you can see, it has to be a qualified professional. So you should be very good in your skills. Then definitely you can get very good salaries in this field. Now coming to the third reason here. So that is diverse career path. So a degree in computer science open doors to multiple career options such as software development, data science, cyber security, artificial intelligence and more. So the versatility of the field allows you to switch roles and industries without needing to change your educational background okay so there are a lot of you can see in computer science so many allied courses are there right in business system data science artificial intelligence machine learning right so with so much diversity with the studies you can easily switch your jobs without changing your basics or the educational background next coming to the fourth important reason why this is a very popular branch that is innovation and creativity Computer science involves solving complex problems and creating innovative solutions. Okay, so this uh, branch has to deal with making so many innovative solutions. So, if you enjoy creativity and innovation, this field provides numerous opportunities to develop new technologies and applications. So, if you are someone who is very much interested about cre making creative things, about innovating different technologies, then definitely this is the right place for you. Now coming to the sixth, uh, fifth important reason why this is a very popular branch that is global opportunities. That is the skills learned in computer science are universal and can be applied anywhere in the world. Okay, So it is not like that you if you are studying in India, you have to be restricted to the India. The job opportunities are available throughout the world because the basic, the knowledge will be same everywhere. Right. The global applicability provides the change to work for international companies or even relocate to different countries. So there is a very high possibility, high offers you will get where you can work like uh, maybe your education is in India, but you can work in abroad. Okay, So that is one of the very important reason the opportunities even in working abroad also increases here. Now second sixth one is your work flexibility. Okay. Many tech jobs offer flexible working conditions including remote work options. Okay, So you can easily complete your work being at your home. Remote work options are available. So during COVID this work from home concept has really grown. So those students or those people who are uh, like in who are much, much interested by staying with family and working for them also this is a very good opportunity. This flexibility can lead to a better work-life balance and the ability to work from anywhere. Okay, so if you are like someone 
who wants to continue traveling with work who wants to follow your passion with your work still you can do it because the opportunities for work from home are also available okay next coming to so there's a reason for this there will be a good work life balance right so if your work life balance is good you stay healthy you can devote time for everything you wish for and you uh, you have a happy life after that now coming to the seventh point here impact on society computer scientists can make a significant impact on the society by developing technologies that improve the lives okay so if you are someone who are interested to impact to put a positive impact on the society then definitely you can develop different technologies which can help for the development of the society next from healthcare to education computer science innovations can drive positive change in various fields okay so starting from like for example we can take a simple example of education right earlier it was always offline education but now we can sitting anywhere any person who is not accessible to who is not able to pay different fees and access the uh, coaching centers and all they can easily stay at home and do education with a good quality of education is available right similarly uh, in healthcare also so many new technologies have been developed which is because of computer science also so definitely if you are someone who are very much interested to put a positive impact in the society this is the right choice coming to the eighth reason here continuous learning and growth the tech field is ever evolving offering continuous learning opportunities and professional growth so there is always you find every day some new technology is devised okay some new technology comes out so it is very important that you have to be updated with this evolving technologies so if you are someone who enjoys learning who enjoys to accept new things then definitely you can have a very good career in this branch for those who enjoy learning and staying updated with the latest technologies computer science provides a dynamic and engaging career so you won't feel like we are doing the same thing every day okay you won't feel like a boredom in your work in your professional life you will be always excited and will always be facing some challenges so that some new opportunities new things have come and you are very much excited to learn it okay so this will work if you are someone who enjoy learning and staying updated right this is the thing that you should keep in mind now coming to the last ninth reason why computer science is so popular among you all is interdisciplinary applications computer science skills can be applied in conjunction with other fields such as biology economics and engineering okay so it is not that if you are doing computer science you have to be only with technology right so there is so much it has interdisciplinary ap- applications in different field also so that is why it is so much in demand people from different field can also work in different field okay they can have a impact in different field this interdisciplinary approach allows you to work on diverse projects and collaborate with professionals from different backgrounds okay so you can work with different people from belonging to different background their knowledge your knowledge can work together and bring some miracles right so here we understood the nine important reasons why computer science is so popular and why you should choose computer science why someone should be like when you choose that computer science i want to do it is not that only that it is having very high salaries that is why we should go for computer science there are so many reasons that can motivate you to choose computer science but here the next question arises is computer science engineering the right choice for you see i told you so many nine reasons why computer science is there or why it should be uh, a very good opportunity why it is a very popular field but again is this the right option for everyone okay so here onwards now i'll be discussing some qualities okay so based on so those students who possess these qualities or some of these qualities are with you definitely you should go for computer science but if not then you should rethink about your choice okay so let us now see what are these qualities which are required for or which are required for succeeding or exploring or being successful in this particular branch so the first one is analytical thinking okay now why you need analytical thinking in computer science okay so that is because computer science involves problem solving and logical reasoning okay so there are so many complex problems that you are going to solve through problem solving and logical reasoning so it is very important that you should be able to analyze the complex problems and develop logical solutions to these problems so if you are someone 
who can analyze these complex problems and have the logical solutions to that then definitely you are a right fit for this branch now second quality here is mathematical skills this is where every student must keep this in mind many computer science and concepts are rooted in mathematics including algorithms and data structures okay so it is very like you can say mathematics is one of the pillar for computer science now a strong foundation in mathematics helps in understanding and applying these concepts effectively so if you are someone who has a strong hold over the subject that is mathematics if you are very much interested you like playing with numbers and you are having a strong grip over this subject then definitely again you are a right choice for this subject this course now coming to the third quality that is curiosity and passion for technology okay why we why we need this cat why we need this quality first of all the field of computer science is constantly evolving with new technologies and advancement while discussing the reasons i also told you that technology changes every day right so every day you need to update yourself every day you need to learn new things so if this is something which makes you happy learning new things or else the, like you are excited about knowing new things then again definitely computer science is the correct choice but if you are someone who is uh, not ready to accept the changes very easily or you are not a person who can so easily adopt to new technologies new updates then again this is not a wrong, right choice for you so a genuine interest in technology and a passion for learning about new tools and techniques is important for staying current okay so what is this i want to tell it little more in this one suppose you are a new technology has come okay if you are readily interested if you are genuinely interested in learning new things you will go do research about this and you will accept it easily but if you are not someone who is very much interested about learning new things daily you will get frustrated because this you have to continue for like your professional career you have to learn every day or every like very uh, frequently you have to learn new things you have studied something you understood something again some new thing will come so if you are enjoying this that is fine but if this is frustrating for you then that is not fine right so that is why you should be someone who is interested in learning new things regularly okay so now coming to the fourth point that is persistence and patience okay solving so as, as i we as we have discussed computer science has many complex problems okay and that cannot be solved within a few seconds okay it needs a lot of patience so solving complex problems and debu debugging the code can be time consuming and frustrating okay so it can be time consuming it can be frustrating also but what should be your attribute what should be your quality for this persistence and patience are the essential traits for overcoming challenges and finding the solutions so definitely if you are someone who can continuously uh, solve these problems who can put continuous effort to solve these problems then it is very good you can join this branch but if you are something someone who gets easily frustrated and cannot manage with this type of stress then then this is not the right choice for you now coming to the fifth point here that is creativity okay so as we have discussed computer science has a lot of scope for creative and innovations right every day you can develop some new technologies and all so developing innovative solutions and designing user friendly applications require creative thinking okay so you need creative thinking on a regular basis so that you can prepare uh, like you can design very good softwares very good uh, you can say applications also now creativity helps in finding unique approaches to problems and designing the appealing interface so you can see so many apps has different interfaces very unique creative interfaces are there so this is because of the creativity nature of these computer science graduates now coming to the sixth and the last point here is self motivation and initiative the tech industry often involves independent projects and continuous learning so we have already discussed you need not wait here that somebody will tell you that you start studying this you will study you have to be self motivated you have to be uh, initiative you have to take from your own side okay something is you have to be always updated always stay motivated to learn new things to exper experiment uh, like experiment new things you should be always ready okay then you can explore you can be successful in this so what should be your attribute here you should be self motivated and talking the initiative to learn new taking the initiative to learn new skills and work on personal projects is beneficial okay so 
Now what all things we have discussed? Why computer science is very popular, right? What are the what are the reasons why computer science is very popular? You might be knowing only one. I hope I, mean, I should not be telling it is correct, but I hope that many of you might be going for computer science because of its very good placement opportunities. But it is not only placement. There are several reasons why computer science is so popular. So we discuss around nine reasons why it is very popular. Now the next thing is we have written different qualities why these qualities are required and whether these qualities are there within you or not to choose computer science okay so yes we are towards the end of this video so recently i have made already a video on why you should not choose computer science there i have told you the cons of computer science and uh, you can watch this video okay and then you can also watch why you should choose computer science and then you have to certain things i'll tell you which you have to consider you have to rethink about these points okay then i'm very sure you can decide whether you should go for computer science or not so the first thing that you should consider is your interest and passion okay your interest and passion so if you are someone who is interested in new technologies in the uh, algorithms in devising new formulas then computer science you can choose it blindly like you can definitely choose it if you are something whose interest and passions is towards technology okay second one evaluate your skills and strength okay so you have to first think that what i said your skills okay passion is there okay you are very much interested about technology but you are very poor in maths you are not ready to learn new things every day your skills and strength do not match with what the computer science requires so undoubtedly skills and strength can be developed with time so if you are motivated to that to do that you are motivated to develop your skills and match your passions then that is very good you can go for computer science now coming to the third one here that is consider your long term goals so just close your eyes and think for the next four years after four years where you want to see yourself whether you want to see yourself in some big corporate offices with very good leaders were very good software engineers or you want to be something else okay so just imagine if your answer to this your long term goals is like a software engineer or a, a web designer or something related to computer science field then definitely choose this branch now coming to the fourth one understand the commitment okay this is important you need to understand what computer science requires okay what commitment you have to give to this branch to succeed in this the first commitment you have to give is to be patience the second commitment you have to give is self motivated third is continuous learning so you have to understand whether these things you can do or not okay so there is no one who can know about, like better about yourself than you right so just analyze ask your heart whether you are able to do these you will be able to commit these to these uh, branch or not now coming to the fifth one seek advice and research okay so again after getting these things also if you are still not clarified or still confused talk to people okay talk to those students who have taken computer science what difficulties they have faced and match their skills with your skills okay so if their skills and your skills are almost same and they are facing some difficulties or they are able to overcome the challenges then obviously you will be able to do it so just talk to people as many person as you can talk to them understand their situation in computer science branch whether they are struggling whether they are enjoying who is struggling what uh, qualities they do not have the person who is enjoying what they are enjoying what qualities they have so just do proper research analysis and then decide okay so the whole point of making these two videos why you should not choose and why you should choose is only that to make you aware of the different scopes that is present in computer science and to motivate you not to choose computer science blindly because everyone is doing it or the the crowd is going towards computer science so just for this don't jump into this branch it is a difficult branch if you are not interested in this you will succeed like there is no limit uh, in this branch if you are very much passionate about this branch so that is why think properly and then decide okay so i hope you have enjoyed this video and if you have found this video helpful please subscribe the channel